When we start doing magic, I think we have a tendency to think that it's all about us. You know, magic's about me. It's about what I do with my hands or what I do with my cards. But think about it. Magic is what your audience perceives. It's the end result. So what your audience experiences and what they remember happening is far more important than what you actually do. Magic for me is not just about tricking an audience. It's not just about fooling someone. Somehow he pulls this string down through the envelope and the string is in the ring. That was burnt. I watched you burn that it. No longer burnt. Shut up. <laughs> This project started off as an experiment. The idea was to interview a few friends of mine, David Regal, Aaron Fisher, and Dan and Dave, some of the most creative and talented magicians in the world. I was interested in what some of the similarities and differences might be between the ways that we approach the art of magic. interviews with Dan and Dave Buck, Aaron Fisher, David Regal, and myself. Performances that stretch from Florida to California, South Beach to the Magic Castle. Uh. <laughs> no way! I, I don't know how you did that, but I'm going to be thinking about that for like the next month, trying to figure that out. <laughs> I'm impressed. <laughs> See the ring? Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> oh, no, did you do that? How the hell? Wait, how did you do that? Take a look. Take a look at it. How did you do that? Oh my god. <laughs> Art of Magic. I'm Wayne Houchin, and I'm proud to present Art of Magic.